Hey friends, in this video I am going to show you how to connect the nodes at the same level in a given binary tree. So for example, if we are given a, a binary tree uh, with the root node 10, left child 5, right child 20, uh, left child 3, 8, right child 25, then the task is to connect the nodes at the same level. So 10 should point to null, 5 should point to 20, and 20 should point to the null. Um, and this is in addition to whatever the data structure we have given. Uh, so 3 should point to 8, 8 should point to 25, and 25 point should point to null. Uh, the key in solving this problem is we have to realize that we have to traverse the tree in the breadth first search fashion. So we have to traverse the tree in 10, then 5, then 20, then 3, then 8, and 25, then 7, and 30. So we have to, so that part we know that we have to traverse the tree in the breadth first search fashion. The key in traversing the tree in the breadth first search fashion is to use the queue data structure. But So we will use that technique, but in addition to using the queue, we will have to do the two things. We will have to save the height of the each element as we traverse, and whenever we traverse, we have to see if we can set its next right pointer to the relevant thing, a relevant node. So let's see how the pseudo algorithm looks like. This, if you realize uh, in our previous video, this is pretty similar to the traversing the tree in a breadth first search fashion. We will create a queue. We will initialize the height of the root to the zero. So this is something new. Then we will enqueue the root and we will loop over the every node while the queue is empty we will dequeue the first node and this is the main part we will have to figure out the logic when we have to uh, reference then when we have to set the next right pointer to either the next node in the queue or to the null pointer and we will do the similar thing of enqueuing every node with its relevant height and so let's see how this algorithm looks like when we implement it so here I have a function called connect nodes at the same level. Here I am initializing the root to the zero, then I am enqueuing it. And uh, I am dequeuing the first element. And this is the main logic. When we figure out when and how we figure out the next right pointer uh, to set it to. So as we already dequeue the first element, if the second element exists in the queue, then we go inside this if condition. And then we reference the first element in the queue and we see if the dequeued element's height and the first element in the queue, the height of both of them are same, then we can set the current temp's next right to the first element in the queue. Otherwise, we set it to the null. Simple enough, right? And uh, in addition to while it's visiting every node, in addition to just pushing it and queuing it to the queue, we set its height to its parent site plus one. So that's how we can keep track of the height. And if I call this function with the given tree, and then if I lock the tree after we call it, uh, we can realize it, it has all the, it has next right reference point, uh, which is uh, pointing to the correct object. I hope you find this video helpful and uh, have a nice day, bye-bye.